Guys, what's up? I am back. I just received the Burning Maze by Rick Reardon. It's in this box right here. I am so excited to open this right now. The first two, it's in the Trials of Apollo series. Uh, the first two were the, uh, the Hidden Oracle and the um, Dark Prophecy. That's it. So... Third one, the burning maze. I can't wait to open this. I'm let's just gonna go, go for it. Go for it. Oh, it's so sticky. What the heck? Here we go, guys. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> there it is. There it is. The Trials of Apollo book three. The burning maze. Oh man, oh, I'm so excited about this. I am so excited. Oh, it looks so cool. Look at this. Look at this cover. Look at that cover. That looks so amazing. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Let's see the first chapter title. I gotta read that. Because you know it's gonna be a bad haiku from Apollo. Oh, here we go. Once was Apollo, now a rat in the labyrinth, send help and cronuts. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's kind of weird. But, uh, I mean, Rick Reardon's books, the titles, the titles of all of his books have been weird. And uh, I love them, honestly. The weird titles are awesome. Oh, this book looks so good. Let's see how many pages this thing is. Let's see how many pages. That's not the last page. Uh, shoot. Where the heck is the last page? Alright, here we go. 419. 419. And in the back also we got a stylish picture of Rick Reed and himself. Nice shades, Rick. So that's pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, th I mean, the appearance of this book, I'll give it 10 out of 10. This is pretty amazing. It's just like all of his other books, the appearance. It's got the nice the nice cover on the front that that comes off, you know, comes off right there. You can take it off. And the book is green this time. never seen a green one. Got a nice Apollo symbol right there on the front. You can see that. That's pretty pretty neat. And, yeah, this, this just looks like a good good book. Book three, book three out of five. So, you know, there's going to be two more of these. Haven't even read this one, so I got three left to read. And, man, that just, that looks pretty sick. That looks pretty sick. Not going to lie. Wait a sec. So, in the front cover, it says, To what is, Melponine, the muse of tragedy, I hope you're pleased with yourself. I have no idea what that means. Does that mean this book's going to have tragedy? Uh, let's hope not. Oh, here we go. The Dark Prophecy, it says, and then it has some words. It says, The words that memory wrought are set to fire. Ere now moon rises o'er the devil's mount. The changeling lord shall face a challenge dire. Till bodies fill the Tiber beyond count. And then there's another stanza. Yet southward must the sun now trace its course through mazes dark to lands of scorching death to find the master of the swift white horse and wrest from him the crossword speaker's breath. The crossword speak. What? Uh, okay, there's another one. To westward palace must the Lester go. Demeter's daughter finds her ancient roots. The cloven guide alone the way does know to walk the path in thine own enemy's boots. What? This must. Be, this is a prophecy, but it doesn't make any sense. All right, then there's two more lines. When three are known and Tiber reached alive, tis only then Apollo starts to jive. I think I remember the jive part, but I don't remember when... That, that prophecy must have been given in the last book. I don't really remember it, though, so that's kind of weird. But, no. Overall, this book looks 
pretty dang awesome. I can't wait to start reading this. I cannot wait to start reading this. So, so yeah. Got a dictionary in the back like always. Or, guide to Apollo speak. With all the words that people won't know. And So, yeah. This is the book. This is the book. Got it for about 12 bucks on Amazon. Not a bad deal for a Rick Reardon book. So, uh, yeah. Hear this for yourself. And... Yeah, that's that's all I have for you. Just showing you this awesome book and all that it's all that it is. So, all right, we'll see you next time.